What's going on YouTube? Uberman here. Look what I got for you guys today. Now I've done videos on these uh, LED tip cups before, but this is a brand new revised version of those tip cups. Uh, take a look at how gorgeous these things are. I mean, look, I was impressed with them before. I thought, yeah, this is a great idea, but um, this takes it to a whole new level, guys. Uh, there's so many colors and so many patterns um, and so many different brightness levels like you can adjust everything now I will tell you you're gonna have to sit around and play with it for a little while like I did but uh, spend about 20 30 minutes with it and you'll have this thing figured out and then you'll be able to set it exactly the way you want it totally customizable the thing is a lot of fun what I what I really like about it is the the number of colors that we have now in one tip cup I think that's really cool and before there was an uh, there was an issue with people saying that it was too bright um, well with this one there's actually a dimmer and it's all on that little wire that I'm holding there's like a little remote control there where you can change everything you can make it really dim you can make it really bright you can make the color strobe you can make the colors flash you can do you can do so many different things with it. Look at this one. Red, blue. Come on. Yeah, there's the blue. And it'll do just like a quick strobe than the green. Now purple. And there's more patterns than just this. You know, I'm going to go ahead and go through them. But look at this. This one, I think, is just beautiful. The way it really slowly and gradually transitions between colors. This one right here is awesome, too. Look at that. That's me just basically changing the speed at which the colors change. This is a beautiful tip cup. It's definitely going to get noticed. It's definitely going to get comments. And it's definitely going to get tips. There is no way you're not going to be able to see this. Now, I do want to let you know that uh, you can get this with either a USB plug on it, or you can get it with a full-sized cigarette lighter plug as well. $39.99, as you see on the screen here www.ubermanstore.com there's no tax that includes shipping $39.99 to your door there's no way you're not going to love these things I use it in conjunction with the headrest tipping covers and I'll let you in on a little secret you need to seed your tip cup okay it's well lit so you can see money in it so what you're going to want to do is take uh, take about ten dollar bills and put them in there or if you want to make it look like you haven't done very well in tips, put maybe a five and five ones in there. Okay, totally up to you. Practice with it, play with it, and see what works best in your market. But at a minimum, I would take a five and five ones and stick it down in there so people can see that other people have tipped. Because believe it or not, when people see tips in there, they, they kind of feel like, wow, I'm a real asshole if I don't tip. You know what I mean? And because of that, they don't want to be an asshole, so they'll go ahead and tip you. You use this in conjunction with the headrest covers. There, there's no possible way you're not going to get a tip. <laughs> By the, I mean, people are going to tip when they see this. Seriously, look at it. It's a thing of beauty. And if nothing else, you should get a five-star rating out of it because it's really cool. And it's not something that you see in a lot of drivers' cars. At least not yet. Now, maybe at some point when this thing gains in popularity... Um, you'll see more and more of them. But until then, this is going to be a really unique product. And passengers are going to be like, wow, that's really cool. I haven't seen that before. And you get to chit-chatting with other drivers. They're going to want to know where you got it from, which is good for me. And it's good for the people that created this, which, uh, which is Tipsters here in uh, Tulsa. Great company. Great people. Legit. Honest. I've had no issues with these tip cups. I've had nobody come back and say, hey... They don't work, or hey, these things totally suck. Everybody has been really happy with them. So I feel comfortable bringing this revised model to you, especially after sitting in the car. And, and literally, I played with this at my desk. I plugged it into my computer, and I played with it at my desk for a while. Then I took it out to the car. I played with it in the car for a while before I even recorded a video. And obviously, I'm doing a voiceover on this. Um, I don't know what happened to the audio, but gone. Um, I do want to point out this is the extra large tip cup. This is like the biggest of the big. This thing is this thing is massive, and uh, I like this one because and the price is the same. It doesn't matter if you get a small one or or a large one or an extra large one or a medium one. 
Price is all the same. Totally up to you if you want a lower profile and get a smaller medium. You want a larger profile, something that just like really sticks out there. Um, I like this because it really does fit snugly in the cup holders, which they all do. But this one sticks up nice and high above the center armrest so that people can, you know, really get a good look at it. Um, with that being said, guys, that's it for the video. Like, comment, subscribe. Get yours today. Be safe out there and Uber on.